One knucklehead is under arrest after he slammed his car into a parked police car. Oh, no. And immediately told the officer he did it on purpose. <laughs> what? Police in Boca Raton say 25-year-old Tate Turner uh, drove through a marked construction area and steered his car directly into a patrol car. He explained to the officer he did it because he wanted to go to jail. Oh, he was told his wish would be granted. But when he was asked why he wanted to go to jail, Turner replied because, quote, he felt like he was already in jail. I'm just emotionally in jail, man. Oh my gosh. My girlfriend won't let me do nothing. The officer <laughs> noted that Turner was not impaired, not suffering any medical emergency, so he believed he really did intend to crash into him. Wow. Turner was arrested and charged with multiple charges. He was on a collision course with stupidity. Oh, yeah. Yeah, he crashed right into my knuckleheads. Like, what the, what, what? Really? Three drivers in Michigan recently proved you don't need brains to do burnouts. You only need a powerful sports car. Police in Dearborn, Michigan, had been uh, seeing a rash of hazardous driving in recent months. They caught three drivers doing burnouts. Yeah, that's where you spin the tires. Yeah, you, yeah, you yeah, keep yeah. the brakes on and spin the tire. Right outside the police station. Oh. The police <laughs> chief could hear it from inside his office. Oh, that's not good. And ran outside to jot down the license plate numbers. He also saw passengers hanging out the windows and taunting them as they drove off. Really? All three drivers were later found and arrested. Well, I'm sure that was pretty easy. Yeah. Yeah, their license, their cars were impounded, and two of them were forfeited to police. They call themselves the Fast and Furiously Stupid. Aww. Those are your knuckleheads. You can find those stories and more wherever you get social media. Just search Mel and Scott in the morning.